Welcome everybody, Joe Marquez here from the Sons of Technology to show you a simple little hack in Google Meet that you can use to have your kids translate your language into their language. And this is great if you have students who speak Spanish, Chinese, Japanese, German, anything at all, and it'll allow you to speak in English and it'll translate into their language. And I want to give a shout out to Efren Tovar, who is the one that showed me this simple little hack. So when you're in your Google Meet, you'll notice that you can turn on your captions. And the captions are going to be linked to the language that you've set to your browser. For example, if I come up here to this little icon or right click anywhere on the screen, I can change my translations. So I want everything down at the bottom to be English. So I'm going to leave that on English. Now what you would tell your students is this. So I have this up here so that you can see that my student has his um, animation head on and I have my normal head on. But my student wants everything I say to be translated into Spanish. So the student comes up here to the top and clicks on the Google Translate icon. They'll click on it. Instead of English, they're going to click on these three dots and they're going to choose another language. That language they're going to choose is the language of their preference. So this uh, instance, we're going to go ahead and choose Spanish. So it's going to translate everything that I say into Spanish. So let's see if it works. I hit translate. Now, if we look at the bottom right down here, notice that everything that I am saying now is being translated to that student in to Spanish. Now, does it work in the opposite direction? If the student speaks back in Spanish, will it translate to English? Well, let's see. So I'm going to turn my microphone off on this account. And I'm now going to turn the microphone on the other account. So this is going to be the student talking. Now, don't laugh at me. My Spanish is quite rusty. So let's see if it works. Notice, remember, we are looking over here at the translation of this account off to the left while the student is speaking over to the right. So let's see if this works. Hola, Mr. Marquez. Notice it translates right over. Let's see this. Donde esta el baño? Where's the bathroom? El queso es muy viejo. So you can see that everything the student is saying in his native tongue will be translated to your language of preference. And now everything that you say in your native tongue teachers will be translated to the students native tongue. This is a great way to incorporate translation into your daily routines. But you remember, you have to train your students how to make those changes. Again, on the students meet page, they will have to turn on captions for themselves. When they turn captions on for themselves, you will see the translation option and they will have to learn to click on the three dots and select that translation. I hope this helps you out uh, connecting more with your students, removing any of those roadblocks that is preventing them from uh, making sure the learning is happening. And I hope this does solve a problem that you may be having in your class. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for learning with us today. If you liked this video, please subscribe to our channel. And, and if you like our channel, please share it out with your friends because we are here to help any and all educators during this time and in the future. Thank you so much for listening and have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful day.